Hey guys, how are you doing today? I know it's long time, but you know, just life keeps every one of us busy. So basically, again and again, this is not a new topic. How you get a good score, it's a system, guys. You have to go all the way through the system to get really a good score. I'm not, I'm not, maybe some of the people can start from this line, which is basically the question that what I heard today from one of the students. You can start from the questions and go up if you really have a good, basic, strong background. But in general, for IMG people, you have you get to start from the materials. Choose the materials that fit you. Kaplan is great. Especially physio, farm, biochemistry, please. Especially physio. Physio and biochemistry, Kaplan, big time. Board review series, also they are good. Board review for pathology, it's a great book. Board review for physiology, I don't know about it, but it's also good. So choose the material that fits you. Whatever the other material, there are, there are a bunch of. But I choose these because I know these. Maybe there are others materials that okay and fit you. But choose the materials that really short. You don't need textbooks, please, that's really short. And you know, you understand what's going on in this material. So basically, that's it. Then please go to the step two, which is basically review. So you have to review your materials. At least you have to review four major books, which is basically pathology, physiology, biochemistry maybe farm and then after that you will go with first aid first aid review first second third fourth five i don't know how many some of the people review it two twice some of the people review it two times ten times i don't know how many times you need to review but you need to understand most of it maybe you need to understand in the first in in this step you need to understand maybe 60 percent of the first aid it's hard work by the way it's very hard work a lot of it tricks there a lot of tricks for the test, but it's very hard. You cannot make it, especially for IMG, and again, you cannot make it unless you go through step one first. And then, after that, you'll go with the questions. Kaplan questions, great source. It's, it's very good, but um, they are, uh, Kaplan usually designed in a way that if you know the books, if you know the books, you can know the questions. Or you can answer the questions, basically. But So if you don't study, if you didn't study the books before, maybe you will have a problem with the questions. What usually I recommend if you can do just 50% of the questions, you will be fine. And the idea of the question is just to know what's going on here, and then you will go to another step, which is basically your word, big time, and I think most of you guys know what's your word how to study this word we talked about that before but you can stay you can still review please you can still review you can keeps review over and over and over and over and over and over and over again maybe some people review 10 times maybe 20 times maybe 30 times but please be patient Review your notes that you are written from the questions. Review first aid again. I don't think it's a good idea to review the materials again because they are really big. But you have to stick on reviewing first aid and the questions that, the, not the questions online, but the explanations of the questions that you are written. So basically here the explanations of the questions that you are or you wrote it down in your special notebook. Again, as I always said, special notebook for the questions, maybe 200, 300 pages. This is your final resources uh, plus first aid. Now, once you will do the questions, the first aid instead of 60% of the first aid that you used to know, that you used to understand it, here the understanding um, rate for first aid will jump maybe to 80% of the first aid you will be able to know what's going on because a lot of your word, basically, especially your word, a lot of your word explanation are, are really resolving a lot of issues with your words. I mean, you, I, I'm sorry, with the first aid. I mean, you will see in first aid some just, you know, just one or two sentences. It's, it's a kind of 
yeah, maybe not so obvious, you don't understand what's going on, but when you'll do questions, you will understand the first aid, as I said, 80%. So that the final stuff for you will be first aid and 80%, I mean, first aid and your word, and again and again and again review. You will still in review, you will still in review line until you get to the online test. And please, again, this is online, not offline format. You will go to NPME 7, 11, 12, 13. The idea, you don't need to go through through all of them. But once you will get a good score in 7, maybe, and 13, maybe because 13 is the last one now, maybe you will get good score, you, you will be ready for the test. And this is your goal. This is your goal, guys. Again, this is important. This is your goal to get really a high score or a good score. And it has to work this way. I feel this systematic way especially works for IMG is it great. So, and the reason why I did this video today, because I surprised still, still some of the IMG people uh, try to start either from step two or from step, sorry, step three or from step two. And this is basically wrong. Sorry, this is wrong, unless, you are already a good person, I mean not a good, I, I, unless you are really have a great, strong background, so you done with the step one in your, in your medical school, so in this case you can go further. But for in general, average people, stick on this plan, you'll be fine. Thank you.